of controversy lately. There is a there probably is an emphasis that we push towards in more technology. But um, personally, I prefer that soccer is kept more as like a pure sport where everything is like um, all the rules are made up like within the white lines. So yeah, I don't really I'm not really a fan of the all the uh, stops and starts of like football and basketball. So just love to see soccer as like a more free flowing game. Uh, I think it would be easy for for them to come up with a technology that says, okay, if the ball did cross the goal line, it should be a goal. Goals don't come around very often, so when they do, they're pretty special. They should count. I'm okay with that one. However, I, th I think there's ways they could come up with something where they could take care of both. For example, almost like football. You give them a limited number of challenges, you get it done within a minute and a half, and it's over and done with. That is a very slippery slope that if it is used for goals, then people would argue why it wouldn't be used for like the smaller things like off the ball incidents. The offsides one is a really tricky one because what I don't want to see is every five minutes, every close offside call, there's a stoppage. The referee's got to run over and look at a look at a replay before we get to move on. That I would have a major problem with. But I mean, it's kind of hard with the with the French getting into the World Cup and then the late the the disallowed England goal. You kind of have to hit, especially on the uh, the stakes that are at the World Cup. You kind of have to. On the big stage, you probably should head towards using more technology to influence decisions.